Governor Camp is expected to address the latest on vaccination efforts across our state. And right now, Georgia is tied with Tennessee for the state with the lowest amount of people vaccinated. Our Sabrina Silva joins us live from Bartow County, where a new vaccination site is set to open tomorrow with how the state is hoping to get more shots in arms. Sabrina, good morning. Yeah, good morning, Robin Grevier. Yeah, this massive vaccination site here at the Lake Point Sports Complex has actually five lanes, and their goal is to get thousands of people vaccinated a day. And there are four other sites just like this one opening up across the state as Georgia tries to play catch up. In one day, five brand new mass vaccination sites will be opening up across the state to take in millions recently added to the eligibility list. We can process about 60 cars in 15 minutes. In Bartow County, the Lake Point Sports Complex parking lot has been turned into a massive site. Others similar to it are opening up in Sandersville, Waycross, Savannah and Columbus. It's the latest effort by the state to get more shots into people's arms as we stand at the bottom of the pole when it comes to vaccinations. We'll do 1,100 per day for the first three weeks, and then we will move to 2,200 per day. The goal is to get as many people vaccinated so we can all get back to what we know as normal. I want to get out, and my family wants to get out. This is an opportunity for us and for people like me to get out and do some things. While it may not be quote unquote normalcy, uh, it's as close as we've been in 12 months to getting it. Now taking you back live here, this is actually two different setups. So there are more tents on the other side of where we're live here to give people the vaccine. And some good news for Bartow County teachers today. They're actually receiving the Johnson and Johnson vaccine later on in the day. And you can, of course, uh, get the governor's press conference on our CBS 46 app. We'll be live streaming that at four o'clock in the afternoon. But for now, reporting live in Bartow County, I'm Sabrina Silva, CBS 46 News. All right, Sabrina, thank you for that.